What's up, you guys? My name is Mary, and with High Priestess, in High Priestess Intuition, welcome my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading, passed through Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid, energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. Free general collective reading, so it's important to only take the messages that resonate, leave the rest. Um, I received a channel at the end. It's actually a really great one. Um, you know I get the crazy ones like this morning. But this one is actually pretty fantastical. Um, just saying, just saying, just saying. I got highly intuitive kitty up here. So, just saying. Uh, we're going to do it, though. We're going to do that on thing. So, all right. So, let's do it. You ain't got to move. You ain't out. Thanks for that. Come here. Come over here. Hey, strike, come here. Okay, well, we're going to do it anyways. Okay, so the channel message I received was someone's family member um, has recently reported that um, your identity has been stolen. It's going to create many series of chain or positive series of chain of events for you. Oh, 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 shoot. Oh, crap. Hold on, y'all. Oh, get up. Come on, try it. Get up. Hey, y'all, hold on just a second, okay? All right, come on. Okay, sorry. Okay, we're going to do it sideways, because that's how we roll. Okay, so someone's family member has recently reported that your identity has been stolen, I heard. Um, for some of you guys, I heard it's a cousin. For some, it is a, um, uh, for some, it's a cousin, and for some, it is a um, uh, extended family member, uh, which cousin is an extended family member, but... Um, However, the extended family member plays in your life, uh, because like I said, cousin is an extended family member, but there's many extended family members, you know, um, could be an uncle, an aunt, uh, um, uh, whatever, um, but I heard cousin and extended family member, um, but I heard it's going to create many positive series of chain of events very positively for you. Um, whoever you are, your identity has been stolen in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, and for some, it is a former employer, and for some, a former boss. Oh, okay, I heard for some, it's a former employer, and for some, it's a former boss. So, we have a lot of identity theft in here, a lot. Um, so, uh, for some of you guys, it's a cousin, for some, it's a, um, extended family member of some shape form or fashion for some it's a former employer for some it's a former boss um but i heard it's going to create so you have to plug yourself in wherever you resonate if you do resonate uh, but somebody's helping you out i'll tell you that they know your identity has been stolen um and they're reporting it i feel official reporting here energy here because i heard many positive series of chain of events are going to occur for you so i think they're officially reporting it and I'm serious about that. I, I do. I think. No, I didn't hear that who they're officially reporting it to. But I do feel official reporting energy here. I didn't hear that. But, I mean, it's going to create a positive series of chain of events for you. So, I feel it is definitely official reporting energy um, to, you know, the correct organization or governmental entity, agency, energy, or person or people or what have you. Um, and it's going to create positive series of chain of events for you, which is super fantastic super fantastical. So you plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates for you. Um, let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, I just heard energy. Okay. Well, we'll do energy. Okay. Many positive series of chain of events will occur from this.
many. Okay, I heard many positive series of chain of events will occur from this many. So many positive series of chain of events will occur, for, uh, occur from this many. But I think many, many positive series of chain of events will occur from this for you. And maybe for the people that help report it for you. Um, I was uh, reading on the website. I was just scrolling through, you know, social media browsing, whatever, what have you the other day. And um, I was reading on there about, um, I happen to just be scrolling through social media. And I was seeing something about um, an article on reporting uh, Medicaid fraud. Um, I don't know how I came across it, but I did. And they, I, I mean, they're all, they offer like cash rewards for reporting like Medicaid fraud and Medicare fraud. Like if you have information on someone that has committed um, Medicare or Medicaid fraud, like they actually give you like cash rewards for legit information on that. Um, that just kind of made me think of it because I was scrolling through and um, and saw that. Um, but I didn't know. I didn't know that, you know, they actually give cash rewards for, and large cash rewards. It's large cash rewards for reporting Medicare or Medicaid fraud. Like, for real, bro. Um, so, you know, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Um, but, you know, that's good to know. But to me, that kind of... Um, that's kind of similar-esque energy is what I'm trying to say. Now, whatever kind of fraud this is, I'm not saying it's Medicare or Medicaid fraud. For some, it could be. We were pulling in Medi uh, Medicaid fraud the other day. So for some, it could be. But it's some kind of fraud, uh, some kind of identity theft, i.e. fraud against you. So um, I was just using that as an example because I happened to come across an article the other day. But um, you really have to plug in your life how it resonates if it resonates for you. However that resonates. But um, somebody's about to help you out. I'll tell you that. Uh, some a cousin, some an extended family member, some a former employer, and for some, a uh, former boss. So you plug it in how it resonates. We got yin and yang on the bottom of the deck. Number 22 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 22. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number. Possible date of birth number. Possible social security card number. Possible green card number. Possible jersey number. Number 22. Yin and yang. This is going to create, help create lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of balance. Lots. And for one particular person in this, a family member will definitely be imprisoned by the end of this. For one, a very, very, very huge fine family member. Oh my God, you plug it in, how it resonates. Okay. So for one of you guys, I heard um, a family member is going to definitely be imprisoned after this. So you got a fam for some, a family member helping you out. For some, it's a former employer. For some, it's a former boss. Uh, I mean, sorry, former employer, former boss. Yeah. Um, former employer, I'm thinking like a company, like might be corporate. Um, um, reporting it is what I'm feeling with former employer. I'm thinking maybe corporate. Now, former boss obviously is not corporate unless you work in corporate, but former boss energy, I'm thinking like corporate, man. I'm thinking corporate level. High, high, high level or like CEO energy or something like that. And I'm just serious. Like high, high freaking level. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates. But it sounds, whoever this is for, it sounds like your family members were definitely involved, at least some of you guys' as family members, because one of you guys' as family members, I heard, is definitely going to be imprisoned after this. So it sounds like by the end of it, they're going to be put in prison when they get exposed, because it sounds like they were the one that committed the fraud against you, this identity, that, it's, I can't speak, the identity theft or the fraud against you. Um, and for some, they're going to be fined a huge, very large fine. Um family member energy. So you had some family members conspiring against you in some shape, form, or fashion, which is going to create the balance. Um, now you have to plug yourself in wherever you resonate, if you do resonate with this. Um, but definitely family members conspiring against you to steal your identity. I mean, how crazy is that? How crazy, crazy, crazy is that? I am just serious as a heart attack. 
So balance energy here. Um, yin and yang is, uh, for anybody who doesn't know, this is, um, um, yin is the female energy, yang is the masculine energy. And it's also like po um, polar opposite energy, um, but it's kind of like salt and pepper, oil and vinegar, um, ketchup and mustard, you know, they're complete opposites, but they complement each other very, very well, which brings balance into the universe, if that makes sense. Um, so I heard balance is going to be restored in the universe, but you know, when you have both of these polar opposites together, it creates balance, which is the yin and yang energy. So this is the balance energy going to be restored. Also that side energy too. Um, for some, some you could be dealing with side possibly or not. Um, you have to plug in yourself, uh, in your own life, how it resonates. A fire sign is definitely involved in this for some. For some, an earth sign. Okay, I heard for some, a fire sign is definitely involved in this for some, an earth sign. So for some, you could be the earth sign or the fire sign about to, um, help someone out um, by reporting this fraud. This identity theft, this fraud, whatever it is, and how we're closing your life. Or you could be the fire sign or the earth sign that someone is reporting on for you. Um, however that resonates, I feel it can go both ways. But definitely heavy earth sign, fire sign energy in here. Whether you are the earth sign or the fire sign about to report this identity theft and fraud and help somebody out. Or you are the fire sign or earth sign that somebody's about to help out and they're about to report it for you. Um, however it resonates. Um, Earth signs are Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Fire signs are Aries, Leo, Sag. You can have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Aries, Leo, Sag. And your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midheaven, or Jupiter charts, if that resonates for you. Let's pull one card and then I'm going to end the reading. Spirit messages you have reflected. The Sun. You could be a Leo. We're dealing with Leo, possibly. Woo. Uh, Leo energy. Happiness, enlightenment, um, happiness, enlightenment, um, shining light on information. In this situation, the enlightenment, i.e. the shining light on the information, would be the revealing of the identity theft and the fraud here. So one of you guys knows about this. Um, or, well, either one of you guys knows about this or... Somebody in your life connected to you knows about this because one of you guys is about to get helped out in a huge freaking way because uh, so, somebody knows about this um, identity theft against you. Uh, I feel you're either a fire sign or an earth sign or the earth sign or fire sign is about to help you out um, or you could be a Leo or you could just they could um, you could just be real damn happy when they do do this when they do. Um, when somebody does help you out in a huge ass way, because I heard basically it's going to create a ton of positive series of chain events for you. I mean, it sounds like it's about to open up a positive, a huge positive avenues for you, and it's going to make you very happy. And I think whoever's about to report it, it's probably it's going to make them happy too, because they might they uh, they might get something out of it too. Um, if they're reporting Medicaid or Medicare fraud, I'll just tell you from the article I read the other day, they will definitely. Be happy, whoever's, if it is Medicaid or Medicaid fraud, because everybody's life situation is different. I'm not saying it is, because I didn't hear that in here. But I know they give out very large cash rewards for Medicare and Medicaid fraud. I saw it in an article the other day. I mean, large lump sums of the money. Um, so if, if somebody's reporting Medicaid or Medicare fraud, they're definitely damn going to be happy. And I'm just being serious as hell about that. Because I'm, I'm serious. So I think it's going to make you happy and it's going to make the person reporting happy, whether they get a cash reward. I didn't hear they were going to. In some situations, they may, some they may not. But I think it's going to make them happy, um, maybe because they're actually doing the right thing and um, performing altruistic um, behavior. Um, I don't know about you guys, but it makes me happy to be good to others. Um, it never makes me happy not to be good to others. I mean, because that always makes you feel negative inside. Why the hell would you want to feel negative? Being spiteful and malicious and mean and nasty to one another. I mean, what positive does that bring out to the universe? Um, none. 
None, in my opinion. None. You know, that's the way I look at it. But you really have to plug in your own life how it resonates. Just saying. Um, let's see if I hear anything. Things are about to go the way they need to go, finally, through many series of chain events. It's going to make all parties very, very, very happy. And everyone will be very well compensated after this. Oh, my God. Whoa. I heard well compensated after this. Holy shit. So, I heard it's really going to go um, the way it needs to go, finally. So... I think the right processes, the right policies, the right way you're supposed to do it, kind of like buy the book energy um, with the other deck I had that has the buy the book in it. It kind of reminds me of like buy the book energy. Um, I didn't hear that, but that's kind of what I'm feeling. Because I heard it's going to go the way it needs to go. Well, you're going to be, what, following all the pol proper policies and procedures and going through the proper reporting agencies and maybe filling out paperwork if you need to fill it out, filling out a report if you got to fill it out. You know, going through the proper procedures, policies, procedures, et cetera, et cetera, through the proper agencies, calling who you need to call, what have you. But I heard by the end of this, it's going to make all the parties very happy. Everyone will be very well compensated, well compensated. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking some kind of reward energy, cash, well, I don't know about cash reward, but some kind of monetary energy, monetary, well compensated. So I'm. It's either money or some kind of gift. Um, whatever well compensated is. I automatically think money, but I can't say it is because I didn't hear money. So I'm thinking gifts. I'm, think, I'm thinking money. I'm thinking money, but you plug it in how it resonates. But all parties will be very happy about this. The one that's about to report for you and you that's about to get um, the help for somebody to report you. Sounds like everybody's going to be a win-win. Everybody's going to be happy. Everybody's going to be into Leo energy. And I'm Leo. I love Leo energy. Just saying. Um, so everybody's going to be happy, happy, happy after all this shit. Um, lots of sun energy here. Number one could be a very significant number in one's life. Number one, it could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number. Possible date of birth number. Possible jersey number. Possible green card number. Number one, the sun. Um, it's going to make everybody very happy, man. It kind of reminds me of like the Ren and Stippy song. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. Just saying. Let me see if I hear anything else. It's going to bring true harmony. Okay, I heard it's going to bring true harmony. Um, but you know, it's going to bring true harmony. So it's going to bring happiness to the person about to report, whether it's your cousin, your extended family member, your former employer, or your former boss. Um, it's going to bring happiness for you, happiness for whoever's about to report or people is about to report, but it's going to bring true yin and yang balance energy too. Um, because it's going, um, I heard one, uh, one of you guys' family members is going to end up in prison by this. And one of you guys' family members is going to end up having to pay a very large fine by the end of this. But it sounds like, in all fairness, they deserve it because they should have never um, performed some kind of identity theft against you, i.e. fraud in some shape, form, or fashion. So you really have to plug it in your life how it resonates. But it sounds like it's going, I heard true harmony at the end of this. So it sounds like, you know, it really needs to happen in the universe because none of that crap should have ever happened to begin with. Um, if that makes sense. Um, that's what I'm gathering from this. Um, let me see if I hear anything else. And your life is about to start speeding up in a very, 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 very positive way. Very. 
And that particular Pisces is about to betray a Libra in a huge, huge, huge way. They feel it's necessary now. Whoa. So you plug it in how it resonates. I heard your life is about to speed up in a very, very positive way. And a particular Pisces is about to betray a Libra in a huge way. They feel it's very necessary now. So um, you might be the Pisces that, that, that's about to betray a Libra. Or um, you could be the Libra that's about to be betrayed by the Pisces. I'm not sure. You have to plug your own self in however you resonate. If you resonate. Only you know your story, not anybody else. But I heard the Pisces feels it's necessary now to betray this Libra. So, however that resonates, um, maybe it's going to make the Pisces happy to betray the Libra. Um, I don't know. But they feel it's necessary now to betray them. So, however that resonates. It can be masculine or feminine Pisces, masculine or feminine Libra. You have to plug yourself in where you resonate. All right, you guys. Well, I love you guys so much. I don't feel you're the Pisces or the Libra in here. I'll tell you that. Um, you could be any sign. You can be any diagram sign that your fa uh, cousin's going to help you out, your extended family member's going to help you out, your employer's going to help you out, or former employer, or your um, former boss. However, that resonates. You can be any sign. Down here, there's a Pisces and a Libra, but I don't feel that's you, if that makes sense. I feel this is external to you. Um, because they feel it's necessary now to betray this Libra. So I think this is external to you. How that plugs in. All right, you guys. Well, I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and I'll stay.